Wells LC Bridge. Students, in this video, we will learn about Maxwell's LC Bridge. It is used to measure self-inductance of a given inductor. Students, we have seen the basic bridge valence condition in previous video. And it is drawn like this. And the balance condition is given by this formula. If we replace these components Z1, Z2, Z3 and Z4 in this way, then a specific bridge circuit is formed and which is known as Maxwell's LC bridge. This is detector D and which is generally either a pair of headphones or null detector. And this is an AC source. This bridge is used to measure self-inductance L in terms of a standard capacitance C4 and two resistances R2 and R3. Here we assume that the condenser is without losses and all resistances are perfectly non-reactive. Now if we compare these two bridges, then we found that Z1 equal to R1 plus J omega L, Z2 equal to R2, Z3 equal to R3 and corresponding to Z4 here be the parallel combination of R4 and C4. It means 1 upon Z4 equal to 1 upon R4 plus 1 upon 1 by J omega C4 and which is equal to 1 upon R4 plus J omega C4. After simplification, we get 1 upon Z4 equal to 1 plus J omega C4 R4 upon R4. Taking reciprocal, we get Z4 equal to R4 upon 1 plus J omega C4 R4. Now the basic bridge balance condition is Z1 Z4 equal to Z2 Z3. Therefore, using these relations, we can write R1 plus J omega L into R4 upon 1 plus J omega C4 R4 equal to R2 R3. Now simplifying that is transferring this denominator parts at right hand side, we have R1 plus J omega L into R4 equal to R2 R3 into 1 plus J omega C4 R4. Expanding the brackets, we get R1 R4 plus J omega L R4 equal to R2 R3 plus J omega C4 R2 R3 R4. Now equating the real parts of this equation, we have R1 R4 equal to R2 R3 or R1 upon R2 equal to R3 upon R4, say equation 1. Now equating the imaginary parts of the equation, we get J omega L R4 equal to J omega C4 R2 R3 R4. Now J omega R4 cancel from both the sides and therefore we get L equal to C4 R2 R3, say equation 2. These two equations represent the conditions of the bridge balance. Both the bridge balance conditions are independent of each other and of the frequency. These conditions are satisfied by successive adjustment of C4 and R4. These are chosen because each occurs in one balance condition only. And the adjustment of R4 will set this condition 1 and will not upset this condition 2 because R4 is not here. And the adjustment of C4 will set this condition 2 and will not upset this condition 1 because C4 is not here. The value of inductance L can be determined from this equation when bridge is balanced. When bridge is balanced, the minimum sound is heard in the headphone or a maximum separation is obtained between the slits of a null detector. Now we will find the parameters of the bridge. Here in this arm of the bridge, Inductance L and resistance R1 are in series. The parameters of the RL series connection are explained in previous video. So we will use those formula and derive the parameters for this series. 
फर्स्ट इम्पिडन्स एंगल थीटा बाय एप्लाइंग द जनरल फॉर्म्यूला फॉर आर एल सीरीज कनेक्शन वी विल राइट फॉर अवर ब्रेज टेन थीटा इक्वल टू ओमेगा एल अपॉन आर वन इन विच वी विल सब्स्टिट्यूट द वैल्यूज ऑफ एल एंड आर वन फ्रॉम दिज इक्वेश वन एंड टू एंड देर फॉर टेन थीटा इक्वल टू ओमेगा सी फोर आर टू आर थ्री अपॉन आर टू आर थ्री बाई आर फोर आफ्टर सीम्प्लिफिकेशन वी गेट टेन थीटा इक्वल टू ओमेगा सी फोर आर फोर एंड देर फॉर थीटा इक्वल टू टेन इनवर्स ओमेगा सी फोर आर फोर नव पॉवर फेक्टर कोस थीटा हियर वी केन राइट कोस थीटा इक्वल टू आर वन अपॉन आर वन प्लस जे ओमेगा एल बिकॉज हियर आर वन एल आर सीरीज कनेक्शन सो द पॉवर फेक्टर इज डिफाइंड लाइक दिस putting the values of r1 and l from equation this and this we get cos theta equal to r2 r3 upon r4 upon r2 r3 upon r4 plus j omega c4 r2 r3 by simplifying we get cos theta equal to r2 r3 upon r2 r3 plus j omega c4 r2 r3 r4 now taking r2 r3 r4 common in denominator therefore we get cos theta equal to this one this r2 r3 cancel with this r2 r3 and therefore cos theta equal to 1 upon r4 into 1 upon r4 plus j omega c4 or cos theta equal to 1 upon 1 plus j omega c4 r4 now quality factor q for r1 l series connection quality factor is defined as q equal to omega l upon r1 substituting the values of l and r1 from equation this and this we get q equal to omega c4 r2 r3 upon r2 r3 by r4 by simplifying we have q equal to omega c4 r4 from this formula it is found that q factor directly proportional to capacitance it means for high quality factor we have to take large capacitor but it is bulky and costly so we use this bridge for the medium range of the quality factor that is between 1 to 10 rather it is also used for low quality factor 2 but for low quality factor other alternative is available that is anderson series so we use maxwell series for medium quality factor only then dissipation factor df it is defined as df equal to r1 upon omega l or which is equal to 1 upon q so by putting the values of r1 and l from this equation or taking reciprocal of the q we get dissipation factor equal to 1 upon omega c4 r4 that's all in next video we will learn about maxwell's inductance series thank you